Hello everyone, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. You know it's kind of a signature video on Christmas to be doing a Citizen Brick Holiday Tin. And uh, if you've been around the channel, you know I've done pretty much every single one up to, I don't know, a few years ago, maybe 2016 if I remember correctly. Um, but this year we got a great surprise uh, when they did their Black Friday Thanksgiving sale. Uh, when you spent a certain amount per that certain amount, you'd get a tin. Then you spend the next amount, you get another tin. If you spent over the maximum amount, you would get all three tins, uh, which is absolutely amazing. Three tins is awesome. They do just come with minifigures, but these are very unique minifigures, so we're going to jump right into it because these are holiday-tastic. We're going to start with the one on the left, which is the ornament tin, as you can tell. So there's standard uh, tins. Uh, you can see right here, nice sticker on it. We do have the ornament head right there. You can see the little hanger on it. Some snow falling around, and we do have a torso on it. So let's pop him open and get him out. These are very unique. Citizen Brick has done ornament heads for Christmas surprises a few years ago, which I actually never had those ones. It wasn't collecting at the time. But here is the minifigure. Very awesome using their new big heads. Uh, this is a red molded head, as you can see. We do have the ornament design printed on there. Nice uh, green triangles with the gold diamonds. Of course, we have the signature neutral face. Would have been really cool to do the um, ornament head all the way around. Or at least, like, I think they might have been able to do it. I know it probably been tricky to line up the sides, but they could have did front and back. But I still love it. He does come with the hook as well, which you can, of course, take these off and hang them on a Christmas tree. I know one of my buddies... Um, in the Lego community did that, which is awesome. I know he's been collecting them. Uh, but you can see it. And you can also pop it out, I'm pretty sure. I don't think they're glued in. Yeah, you can pop them out as well. If you want to, but what's the fun in that? Let's pop it back on. Focus up. There we go. Coming down to his chest and torso, we do have the hoe with an exclamation point. And a red snowflake on there. And we do have some short legs on this little guy. Nothing on the sides. We got some green arms, red hands. He is pantsless because he has red legs. Same thing as this side. And then nothing on the back. Again, it is a Christmas tin fig. Nothing too crazy. Uh, last year was the JT one, I think, which was a good one, actually. So, we got ornament head right here. So I'm gonna, I guess that's what I'm going to call him. Set him to the side. Got a stand. Uh, I think this one was in the middle. Next one we have the candy cane head. You can kind of get a hint at which head this one is. Of course, we have the neutral face, red body, and it's snowing. Again, standard tin. And this one also is short legs. I think they might all be short legs. Yep, they're all short legs. And here he is. We got candy cane head. So, of course, the new long heads by CB that's been happening a lot recently. This one's all white. And then we do have... Oh, it's pretty loose. We do have the... Nice red and green cotton candy stripes. I know they have a lot of different candy cane stripes. You can have traditional red and white. You can have red and green. They got multicolors. They got weird flavors. This one's probably the peppermint due to the thin green and red lines. So peppermint candy cane head. Of course we have the traditional neutral face. And then coming down to his chest and torso. We have red torso this time with the white snowflake and the hoe exclamation point. Uh, it is a different version of the hoe. So we got the hoe and hoe. There's a lot of hoes in this video. <laughs> oh, what a great time for Christmas. Uh, you can see this one's more like uh, italicized, um, like fine point. This one is block letter. And then coming down to his legs, no printing. We do have him pantsless again as well. They're all kind of wearing their holiday sweaters. Green arms, white hands, no printing on these sides of the body. Same thing as this. And nothing on the back. So we got a little happy candy cane head guy, or peppermint head, whatever you want to call it. Oh, they could have, oh, maybe ideas for next year, don't want to spill them. So love them. So we got the second hoe fig. And to the last one, you can tell which one this one is. This is going to be wreath head. And you can see right there the traditional Christmas wreath with a neutral face, snowing, standard tin. Pop him out, he has short legs. And we have a hoe. So there we go. So the wreath head, so if you remember CB Day 8, they had the donut boxes. So this is the donut heads. Of course, this one's all green, and we have the wreath printed on there. A lot of glare on this one. Uh, you can see the neutral face on there with the nice wreath, red little bow. Those leaves kind of look a little bit sus, like a dime bag kind of style. 
but I love it. Coming down to the chest and torso, we have a white torso. This looks like a gold, uh, that's a gold snowflake, that's sick. Nice little shiny gold uh, snowflake. We have a very cursive hoe with exclamation point. Then we got his green legs because he is pantsless. Red sleeves, green hands, nothing on the sides. And then nothing on the back. Again, I think they probably could have did back printing on all these. I know, it again, it's a Christmas tin. It's kind of just like, uh, either it could be a quick fig. There was three of these, so I know they probably had to make a lot. But um, you could have did like a full effect, just like the green leaves on this side. Or I guess you don't see the back of a wreath. But the candy cane, maybe the ornament one. But that is our last little um, Christmas fig. I know these are pretty quick. Like I said, there's only... Uh, Front facing and torso prints on these guys again. Um, these were the uh, free holiday gifts if you spent a certain amount, which I absolutely love. I love making these Christmas videos. These videos are always uh, fun to make, kind of getting to the end of the year, stuff like that. Um, so absolutely love them. Great job, Citizen Brick. Uh, I know there was three, so I'm curious what you guys could do next year. I know you've been doing a lot. I know they had a Jesus one. Um, we had the JT Lonely Island one last year. We had, we've had Santa. We've had elves. Um, I God, I can't even remember. It's there's a, a bot. Was there a botany one? I can't really remember. Uh, but there's been a lot. Absolutely love them again. Great job. Uh, Merry Christmas, everyone. Happy holidays. If you don't celebrate Christmas, um, I don't know if you can still get these. You'd have to ask CB maybe if you made an order. I know they. Did said something on their Instagram, so you can check all that out if you maybe can get a tin. I know they were throwing them in orders recently. Um, other than that, again, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. Hope you all have a great end of the year. Um, if you want to check out my other system free videos, click right up here or links will be down below. Be sure to leave a like if you ever liked the video and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. And as always, thanks for watching.